I made three versions of Flappy Bird. One in one minute, one in ten minutes, and one in 60 minutes. Quick explainer. Flappy Bird doesn't actually fly forward. The bird just goes up and down while the pipes and floor slide left. That's how it looks like it's flying forward. In one minute version, there is no time for sprites. I made two circles. Yellow for the body, red for the mouth. Added a rigid body for gravity and one line of code. Hit a key and bird jumps up. There is no time for pipes or background or floor or anything. For the 10 minute version, I spent three minutes drawing pixel art for the bird, pipe, background and floor. Then I spent 2 minutes on creating the game objects and the pipe manager script to spawn new pipes. I asked Copilot for the code, but it failed. So I spent the last 5 minutes fixing the code. Didn't manage my time to have the collisions and Bert can go through the pipes. Yay! In my real attempt, I drew better art, wrote my own gravity and flap logic, built a pipe prefab with colliders, random heights, scoring triggers, moving floor, a score manager, collisions for game over and the UI canvas, and some basic flying animations. And finally it looked like a real game. Long story short, trying and coding a real game teaches you a ton of stuff, even one minute or one hour. You'll learn to prioritize things, what is important or not important. Follow for more game development insights.